Hey there, so today we have another review and this is a beer from Treehouse, this is Sap. So uh, classic, classic beer from them, I remember enjoying this many years ago. And this is their Chinook Simcoe hop filled American IPA. So their take on um, these, what I think some people would call generally more aggressive hops, but really just honestly very delicious hops. And uh, they express notes of grapefruit, mango, and pine earthy spice on this one. So uh, perhaps our most complex IPA, really. High praise for one of their beers. All right, again, beautiful, wonderful, wonderful head creation on that one. Uh, this beer is actually yeah, around the range of their colors of their beers. I'd say, yeah, light gold, um, pretty hazy, like full on, medium plus full on hazy, uh, wonderful head creation on that. <sighs> Two weeks fresh. I get melon. Melon is one of them. They call, they call grapefruit, mango, pine, and spice. I get like freshly cut into like melon, that kind of like sweet note. I get there underneath kind of like light um, Dilly Malt character and yeast expression. Is that like fruity, uh, is it? A little bit of that bubble gummy thing. Juicy fruit thing, cheers. So, yeah. Uh, for a beer that highlights Chinook and Simcoe that I think some people do like uh, call a little bit dank sometimes. This is just like a fruit bomb, yeah. A lot of juicy fruit on this one, a lot of mango, a little bit of spiciness on the back end. A little bit flabby though. There's a little bit of that kind of like, what is that? Let me go back. It's like a, um, a sprucey fruit. So it's like spruce laden slash pine laden tropical fruit. So it's like pineapple mango with that kind of spicy and like a forest green kind of character. Almost a little cologne right? And then there's a little bit of this kind of like light touch of like sweet doughy malt in middle. A little crackery as well. And on the back end, the hint of that kind of like, oh, that's what it is. There's a hint of that rosy hop character. A bit floral on the back end. And then I also get a little bit of like sweet yellow grapefruit as well. Wonderful, nice beer, yeah. That kind of pine thing just really lingers quite nicely with those juicy kind of sweet hops up front. Grapefruit, mango, pine, earthy spice. <laughs> now that I drink it more, it's like pretty spot on. Granted, it's always confirmation bias, but like you're always looking for them and sometimes you don't find them, but like when they're hit, they hit. Also for sure they get some like, like cantaloupe notes too. Mm, nice. The fun one with this one, there's just this like really pretty little bit of like evergreen character dancing in here. Um, it fits, I, I, I mean, I think this is a seasonal where it makes sense to put this around like fall and winter. It just has this little, little bit of piney thing, but still like, you know, treehouse juice. But this is like really pretty kind of just like forced, kind of like New England, kind of like, you know, um, uh, tree, uh, leaves changing colors and just this kind of, kind of like, almost like sap there you go uh pine resin you know it's just like all those pretty notes right in there but it's like a little bit spicy too um love it i love how unique that is that's a really really fun way to express um hop character and play it with all those like really lovely new england hop characteristics but then also offer something a little bit different like you know i think we're just gonna be all that all at some point tired of like orange mango pineapple passion root oh it tastes all the same right like i was offering that little bit of like Complexity is delicious, and as they describe, it's one of their most complex IPA. So, hard as hell. I love that little bit of transitioning. Um, very good. I still think the Alter Ego is better, but pretty crazy. Uh, this beer for me, that beer actually had, probably should adjust on the ratings. That probably should be a 99. This one gets a 98 for me. 98. This is, this is a 98. That's some good haze. Ninety-eight, ninety-eight. Uh, that's sap from Treehouse. Absolutely fantastic. Until next time, guys. Cheers. Later.